Uh oh, it's in there. Are we good to go? Yep. Okay. Uh, hey everyone, this is Powerful Podcast episode number four. Quattro. Sorry about the long delay between <laughs> podcast episodes. Kind of been busy with life. Which sucks, means no gaming time, which we got a lot of game time anyways. He's lying, we have no lives. Now when gaming epic, is a epic life. Rant, was destroyed by beautiful life. By Lama game. It's a beautiful life. Life. Filled life. I will show you the world of gaming. World. Nintendo, something PlayStation, and Dreamcast. What happened to the Xbox? Bastion, Lol, the Xbox and so hates many us all. Games I don't need a girlfriend. I Where need a do I begin? A whole and suddenly this has turned into world. a musical gaming podcast. And Willow's got his blow up Donkey Kong. Would he does stuff with every night such as cuddle and hug and, and rub bananas. him on his red rug but it's by bananas and to the introductions I mean penis <laughs> and then I am my Jedi pony to read this musical we can't see your hands I'm lamaking and I feel violated I'm always dancing and I got a voice of an angel and I'm Mark Light and I'm naked you always have that. I'm Mark Clay. And I'm Mark Clay. I'm Mark Clay. And I'm Mark Clay. And I'm Mark Clay. <laughs> and I'm a pissed off. And I'm Mark Clay. It's my thing, okay? It's all I got. Man, I mean, just keep giving us the finger the whole night. It's like everything all we do wrong. Night. You're such a bitch. It's like, change it up. Yeah, go with the index. <laughs> my mama told me. My mama told me. We we should, we should, let's, let's just put a, a musical in the middle. Just we double. My mama told me! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I love you, double. I really Anyways, hope that was not picked up on the mic. Um, I I agenda for today um, is uh, typical what we played this week, although this week is turned into this month. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> we have no second segment because we were going to do Heavy Rain, but then we decided no. Well, so we're going to we'll just, just do. We'll talk about it like, during that we're week. We're just going to yeah, do yeah, we'll 40 minutes of silence, week. right? Yeah. Okay. Um, 40 minute meditation time and then last topic we have a new idea we're proposing to you guys and girls possibly mostly and guys. young children and adults and grandparents and everybody who listens to our podcast except animals and gingers I'm pretty sure that <laughs> our podcast is only listened to by animals with it being left on so they don't feel lonely <laughs> Hey, what about me? Used, at least it's being used somehow. Wow, that was just a shot at our hearts. <laughs> some podcasts you probably aren't even used for that. Yeah, we're they're lucky. probably just listened to by themselves we're over lucky. and over, and I probably I end up being all the hits on their sites. I listen to many podcasts. I come like a third but... of the hits on our website. <laughs> What's that? Anyways. Um, so why do we... See you later, Jedi. <laughs> We have just he's letting, lost a letting, member. He's letting his dog out. That's innuendo for his penis. He's got to rub one out. <laughs> we'll uh, chit chat till he gets back. Patty whack. Give a dog a bone. I think we can just go ahead with what we played. Yeah, might as well. Okay, what did you play, Arclay? I don't want to go first. Well, that's you... tough. <laughs> no! I'm going. Mama King, what did you play? Because so you always is... go first. Oh, man. That'll be this that is tradition. for like the entire month essentially, isn't it? Yeah, pretty much. But I mean, if just don't like if you play if you're playing games that you've mentioned before, just don't mention them. Just just keep it shorter. Well, I did a bit of a earlier with um, CS with Bastion. you. Yes, Bastion. <laughs> I beat Bastion. You beat it? I beat it. I stayed up till two in long, the morning man. last night finishing it. Yeah, I was like Will's on. I was like Will's on pretty late. Oh, uh, he's playing Bastion. That I was <laughs> I was watching a show. I saw you were on, and then I finished that show, and then I decided it was time to play. Yeah, such a good game. Anyways, what else? And I just started playing Dragon Age Two Legacy DLC. Nice. How's that going? That is going good. It's better than the original game. I like the original game. This one is more challenging. They've they're already correcting a few things that people have been complaining about from the original. That's good. And like like I already said, it's already been more challenging with encounters. I went into one room just grabbing loot. I walked out, and there was about 20 guys shooting me in the face. <laughs> the uh, face. <laughs> the with face, what? The face. I knew you were going to say dumbass. that. 
Oh. <laughs> they were shooting you with swords and rainbows and unicorns. And puppy dog. What have they made better? Or is that a spoiler? Um, one of the complaints was that there was not a lot of environments. They've right. already... <laughs> They've, I agree. <laughs> I, I I can like, see that, but I never found that a problem because it was supposed to be around Kirkwall, so I never found that to be that such a valid complaint. Yeah, just I, people trying to find. I thought like like the backdrops to the environment's really good though. Yeah, the like, oh people just like a change of scenery regardless. Still, it's supposed to be Kirkwall. Mass people one, are t- anybody. People are trying to bitch around. I actually no, I actually times. for Mass Effect One, I found that was effective for the. Uh, for the Uncharted Worlds. The bunkers, though. No, I had I had no problem with the bunkers, but it's because it's the idea that all these things were pre-manufactured. So Those you're bunkers you, weren't, though. It's No, but it's the idea that <laughs> all these things were made by the same companies. They were made f- just for that reason. They're not specially made for all this stuff. And so I f- found it worked more effectively than people just complaining. But they've already been changing the scenery up quite a bit in Legacy. Will you make my elf eyes see? See things I did not before. What the hell? <laughs> what else did you play? Um, Is that it? Yeah, Bastion was pretty much the thing I've been playing the entire time. That's been very good. That's Hell yeah. That's currently, with how things are going, that's my number two game of the year. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Arclay, right, what did you play? Well, well, I finally finished Vanquished. Vanquished. Yeah. Vanquished? Did you actually finish it? I did finish it. I sat down and was like, I'm going to beat this because I have, what, how many games coming up like in the next month? Next next week we have four. Yeah, this will be fun. Uh, I beat Vanquish <laughs> finally. It was awesome. Yeah. Super fast paced. The is writing... It, is it repetitive? Uh, actually, it repetitive. I didn't find it actually that repetitive. I found a few things stupid. The fact that you could only melee one enemy at once and then you would overheat your your booster. And then you couldn't, like, dash around like a crazy mofo. Oh. Sometimes in the boss battles, what they'll do is he'll, like, they'll, like, remove the safety on your boost so you can just boost around, like, crazy super fast. Nice. I would, I don't know if there is a mode where you can just play with all the boost off like that, but that would be awesome. But, um, like, in the final, like, the final boss, you get your boost unhitched. And it was, like, he's, like, unhoost the, bo- uh, the boost. Unhitch the boots. Yeah. Unhoost the boot. <laughs> Unhoost the boot. <laughs> Unhoost the boot. <laughs> Unhoost thine boot. Um, but he's like, un- unhitch me. I gotta beat this guy. I- he's raping me, and I had him down to like ten health at this point. <laughs> and then it's like unhis un fuck. Unhitch. Unhitch. The the booster. The, the booster. booster. <laughs> but it was stupid because I didn't need to un. Pitch the booster. booster. <laughs> what's, the, what's the story reason behind them not letting you have your full suit's potential? Because it can hurt the guy or something, because he can do way too many awesome things. That's is it like adrenaline reason. overload and stuff? Uh, or? Well, like it's a booster on his suit. Like, he's Iron Man on drugs. So is it like going into him, like the crisis suit, where it's like nano? No, it's just like exoskeleton sort of thing. So it's like Iron Man's suit, like he's encased in it, okay, but it doesn't so it's give like him anything special. Okay, so it's like his organs would go too fast or something? Uh, well, like, yeah, it would It would just put, like, too much G-force and all that shit on him. Pressure and stuff. That makes yeah. sense. Oh, okay. So, but it would be, like, it was so much more fun, because you could just dart around like a crazy motherfucker, and you just had no hope of hitting you. <laughs> the writing was okay at some points, but then at points where it was just... Like, you see this giant ship come at you, and the guy looks at it, he's like, It must be a thousand feet tall! And I just thought that was really gay <laughs> for some reason. Like, I got physically mad. It's the guy who voices Ogryn. Oh, okay, yeah. Steve Blum, I think? Yeah. Yeah, so, and, and he swears a lot, and it makes me smile every time he swears, because he's fucking awesome at swearing. Nice. Was he brings there class to swearing. What? Was there, <laughs> uh, was there arc light jokes in this game? Mm-hmm. I don't know what you classify as an arc light. A really good joke? Uh, Maybe. No. <laughs> 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 no, it's, it's one of those jokes where it's like... Yeah. Huh. Such as... I would like an example, please, of an arc light joke. Why don't you come with, the, with a joke? And I'll tell you if it's an arc light joke or not. I don't want to. It's too much pressure. I can't perform under pressure. Or when people are watching. That's Fun what fact. she said. Uh, uh, see, that was an arc light joke. No one really laughed. You laughed. What no, it was a chuckle. Yeah, yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. 
Well, I beat Vanquish. I played the Space Marine demo. Yeah, how was that? I actually looked pretty You were all watching me, except Will. Will yes. Everyone likes Will. Ah, it's all of us. I was doing cooler things. You were masturbating again, weren't you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. Well, Shit. Back to the I got to board. blow up people's faces, and it made me smile. Like, I beyond they, belief. I wish they put more kill sequences in them. Yeah, they might have more in the full game. I will tell you yeah. all at a later date. I'm assuming... Well, you can't... You only can do it with your melee, though, can't you? You can't. I know, yeah, but they might have... That was just for the chainsword. I'm pretty sure you can get other melee okay. weapons. No. I'm sure you they can. They got ad ads for it now on TV. I was watching Space Today, and they're doing yeah. it like this day. And then they're like, download the demo! Yeah. And put putting that over, like, buy our game! Instead, yeah. it's download the demo, <laughs> don't buy well, our game! Well, like in, in the Warhammer universe, they have, like, chain swords, power swords, yeah. like, giant power fists. Hammers, power fists are baller as fuck. Cool. It's just a huge fist on your arm. Like Fallout Three, powerful. yeah, exactly. That's where Fallout. came. I don't know if that's where Fallout Three got it or if that's where Warhammer got it. But I think eh. it came before Fallout. This yeah, I'm pretty yeah. they've been doing this stuff for a long time. It's been since like the seventies. Yeah, it's old. Yeah. Or did they get it from Nintendo? Or did Nintendo get it from Jesus? Yeah, did Jesus? Did get Jesus it have a power fist? Well, you gotta realize that game. Games Warehouse, the guys who make all this stuff, have been around for a long time. The All the stuff that Blizzard was doing that made them popular was supposed to be games for them, and then they decided not to do the games with Blizzard, and Blizzard just kept all the same stuff and made them. That's why they look so similar. Is that yeah. they had all the stuff ready, and then they said no, and Blizzard decided to keep on going with their stuff. So that was kind of a bad decision for on them. Yeah. I didn't, yeah, I haven't tisk, really tisk. overly played all that much. Like, I... Oh, I played the Sonic Genesis Collection. The one I bought with that those return games. <laughs> and we played... My brother and I played Streets of Rage 1. He thought the animations were terrible, but that's because he's a bitch. So then <laughs> we skipped nice. Streets of Rage 2 and went to Streets of Rage 3. What, what, uh, what kind of game is Streets of Rage? It is a side-scroller beat, beat the shit out of everything. It's like that game we played, um... Uh, uh, These are like the old Sega? arcade yeah. games. Yeah. But instead of going from card book, co uh, comic book picture, it's like... Yeah. Move, yeah. and then like arrow points. Yeah. Move. Yeah, and then... These it's are like, old um, arcade it's games. It's like that side-scroller X-Men game. Oh, okay. So, we definitely play that. Um, the thing that I... Like, I like it at the same time is... Uh, it, it doesn't annoy me, actually. It makes me laugh my ass off that you can... There's friendly fire. And I just jump in the air and I do ninja kicks to everything oh in the boy. face. So <laughs> I ended up uh, probably doing more damage to my brother than the other team, like all the enemies did. Nice. Because <laughs> I just kick him in the face all the time. And if you like, if you walk into your partner, you can sort of do special moves that normally would hurt them. But if you do it the right way, you'll just hurt everyone else except him. Mm. Like you run up to him, yeah. jump over him like you would an enemy, and then you can normally do a grab move with one button where you'll bend back and smash his face into the ground. Nice. Or if you jump again while you're flipping over him, you can jump in the air and do like a flying slide tackle. That doesn't make any sense, but you can fly in the air and tackle somebody. And it's hilarious. That's pretty cool. You do an elbow drop of epic proportions. Nah, that, sounds, that, sounds like, that sounds like Baki in uh, yeah, a uniform. It would be. It, we gotta play it. It's so much fun. Oh yeah, I heard it was really good. And then, yeah. uh, like, and it's got. I was gonna buy all the Sonic games on arcade, and I was like, wait, they're like five bucks a piece. This thing is twenty, and it's got like seven of them. Oh, well, it's got four, right? Well, it's got all the Sonic games. It's got Sonic and Knuckles, which is my favorite one. Cause it's I got didn't fucking like that Knuckles one. in it. It's got Knuckles in it. I found like there's this one thing and I couldn't get by. Knuckles. Knuckles, so, like, Knuckles, is, you and Knuckles is the boss. He's he's a redhead, you damn it. He's a fucking fox thing. He's not, not a redhead. No, it's a chinda. A chinda. Kinda. A chinda. A chinda. Well, that's not a, a ginger. There you go. He has thing. points on this. I don't know anymore. God damn it! I blew your mind. It's a kidna. Uh, so then my brother's like, I don't want to play these fighting games anymore. So he's like, What else should we play? And I was like, He's like, Oh, Golden Axe sounds cool. It was the exact same thing except medieval times. That game's so good. Golden though. Axe I is love so. Golden I, we Axe. played a we played a duel where you just fight one on one with each other. And, like, the game, like, you miss so many times with your hits that we just ended up jumping in the air at each other and trying to joust by throwing or nice. hitting each other in the face with our weapons. And, like, they're fun. They would be fun drunk games to play. Yes. Just like a big fun mindless, game, so it's not... Like, 
the, a lot of them are really similar, but they haven't lost their t- like their fun with their uh, their nostalgia. Is still there, the, like they are are all fundamentally the same, but they're so different at the same time. Mm. Well, yeah, they didn't have a whole lot of yeah. They didn't really have and, like, a lot of technical yeah. advances to and be able to do different things. <laughs> like in Streets of Rage Three, all the enemies are Mexican. They all have Mexican names. It's like Garcia and Ricardo Cortez. Is this the series where you fight, like, transvestites and stuff? There are some transvestites. I noticed some <laughs> S&M police officers hitting me with their whips at one point. Nice. I started laughing my ass off. And I just... Deadly. And, um, I can't Thank remember you. if it was in one or three Streets of Rage, but when you do enough damage to some of them, they drop down on their knees and they shudder, and I just laughed. Oh, my God. Uncontrollably. Uh, that's all I've really done. Ugh. Um, yeah. Really? Yeah. Played a little bit of Mass Effect 2. Just to do Garrus's uh, alignment mission. Er, loyalty. Loyalty mission. Get it right. <laughs> Shut up, bitch. I just love Garrus. Garrus is the man. Well, is the man. The do you man. do par- do you do friendship or... Wait, that's... You get it either age. way. So. Spoiler! It's no. old enough that I'm allowed to talk about That's it. That's true. It so is. You, you need to do the Paragon. Did you know that at the end of Ocarina of Time? No, it came on three days. You can't spoil it. <laughs> Too bad. Denied. Oh, so Star Fox 64 3D comes out this Tuesday. Oh. Just on a random note. Yeah. It's one of the first <laughs> games I ever played. I love Star. I felt I let Ga- should let Garrus have his revenge. You just shoot the get fucker through. in the face. No, that doesn't work. Either way, you get the loyalty. You can either let the he wants to kill this guy. You need him back in shape, though. He's gonna be brooding the entire time. Mm, whatever. <laughs> He'll be good. He killed him! He it's, killed him! It's better that he figure everything out by himself and everything go right the Paragon way. That's not letting him figure Paragon. it out, though. Yeah. yeah. No. He's, he's allowing the guy to redeem and he's not killing the guy in cold blood. He's not in cold blood. blood. Oh, yeah. No. It's with a sniper rifle from right. far away. Yeah, that's totally warm. <laughs> Unless you count the bullet blood. being cold mm, by the time it kills blood. him. <laughs> but he's a birdie. He has really we warm blood. We should probably stop this Mass Effect talk. This thing, yeah. uh, I've seen him go on for like 20, 30 minutes. I'll just go back and forth and... Spoil the well, whole game for everyone. Well, uh, we didn't talk much about other. Bastion, but next podcast, when he actually finishes Bastion, we can really When you say that with it. such a scathing tone, when I he actually finishes Bastion. it... No, we we can talk more about it, and then I can make sure. Don't I make didn't me spoil. bastion your face in. You can, you can talk about more like game features and stuff. I'm not worried about. Yeah. No, don't spoil it bastion. for me. Bastion. <laughs> Such yeah. a good game. Why? And as always, I played LOL. Lots and lots of LOL. Well, stupid guys. No, you couldn't really say that before. You didn't play that much of LOL before. You're playing more now. Yeah, you play a lot more now. In that last podcast, I played a lot. That's when I got hooked in. <laughs> no. Stupid. We're gonna get you Articuno. Fuck my Articuno. We'll wait till, wait till it's my turn to Am I the only <laughs> one who does not play this yep. game? Yep. And that's why we hate you. You guys I don't know why you just don't play no with way. us, because, I mean, we, we most of our games are probably not gonna be even that serious. I mean, they're resetting everything pretty much soon anyways. Well, we need to play more Counter-Strike, and we got Magicka we still gotta play as well. That's true. Magicka. What? Deliciously good game. You think these guys would be able to play Magicka or No Byron it's not Byron's game. Luke tried, he can't run it on his computer. I can try again. It I might work this time. I will not work my computer even if I wanted to try it. But porn <laughs> works, right? What? Porn works? Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, I got my I would laptop, feel terrible for I got you. my Xbox. Porn entertainment, I'm fine. Well, you could also switch those around. You could have entertainment on computer and just get like dead or alive volleyball. There's your Xbox porn. You're a sad, pathetic thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the truth comes out! Well, just a dagger to the heart. Coming from the man with the inflatable Donkey Kong sex doll, this means nothing. Just a dagger to the heart. <laughs> I have standards. I have stabbed my Donkey Kong blow-up doll. It's now Yoshi. Well, it can't Step be off! Uh, really nothing will ever be worse than, it, than that inflatable funny- donkey with the fucking felt patch over his The asshole. funny thing is that you guys are going to get somebody to listen to it, and I'm going to get introduced to somebody, and they're going to be creeped out to the hell. And they're you gonna guys? Like, what do you mean by you guys? We're all women. <laughs> we just have a really deep voice. What? We, you, don't, you don't accept females now? 
talking Anyways, about you getting, guys. We're getting heated. What do you mean, you guys? Heated and off track. Us, us three now? Are you saying yeah. that because I'm white, Byron's white, and Michael's Asian? We're like, uh... You totally skipped our names. Thank you very much for that. I'm like an Oreo. We know it. How are we like, like Oreo? Backwards. We're like a backwards, backwards golden, golden Oreo. Oreo. And then there's, there's <laughs> two layers of icing and one cookie in the middle. Or maybe your <laughs> banana cream filling. <laughs> I don't like bananas. Can we be uh you don't like much of anything, do you? I like lots. Just not bananas. Yeah. Or peanuts. <laughs> he can't have peanuts! <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> You're a double standard whore and I'm gonna eat peanuts. That's not a double sta wait what? <laughs> yeah, I can't have peanuts. Of course he does. Barbecue well, peanuts. Fun peanuts. fact, yeah, they're also in your good. pockets. Barbecue peanuts. What? Nice. They're on sale. Remember who's plan. next. I'm next. I'll right. go. Yeah, go dice dancing. roll. I played Bastion. Yeah. Probably one of my top game indie games so far. Um, it's just I haven't found anything bad about it. Like any, if I did find anything bad about it, it'd be like a minor. His pick. arms are huge. Arclight's just a picky idiot, so I that's what that he the, doesn't like about the game. The movement sometimes is a bit weird. The movement sometimes translate. is a bit weird, though, but I mean, I'm assuming most people would switch to a gamepad. Yeah, so, it's I mean, probably it's a not lot that bad. There's one sequence I can see being a lot easier on gamepad. I nearly died around the end, and it really scared the piss me off. Well, especially if you're like ro the type who, like me, who likes rolling around a lot. Yeah. That's me. At least so, falling damage is so very, very little. Crazy. Yeah. So that'd be the only minor crypt. Sometimes it, you fall off a level. Um, but yeah, everything else is just top notch. For 15 bucks, I mean, it's like probably one of the best deals you're ever going to get, in my opinion. Like, I paid 25 for it. I don't know about you, or, or Will, Lama. Lama King. You forgot his name, didn't you? <laughs> Lama, what, what, how much would you pay for Bastion? Lama King. I would have paid a lot more. I ended up buying the soundtrack as well. How much is the soundtrack? The soundtrack is... It's just... this. It's 10 bucks, basically. It's nine ninety nine anywhere you can get it. Hmm. Maybe I'll have to pick that up, too. Because oh, their music is really good. It's really good music. Uh, what else? I also downloaded this demo for this old-school game called... Uh, Maldita Castilla. It's like a... Uh, Sounds sexy. Oh, no, it's like a. I don't know if you guys ever played or heard of Ghosts and Goblins. Fucking yeah, I've, yeah, yeah, yeah. The old, old school game. Yeah, I've heard of Grab by the Ghoulies. <laughs> what? Anyways, <laughs> it it's sort of that type of game where it has like a little bit of history behind it, <laughs> and it's like Spanish Europe slash European history. It's just a side scroller platformer, really simple. Uh, it's made 16-bit. <clears throat> Super good. I can't, I'm probably gonna get the full version when it comes out. I only have the demo, so. And, uh, what else did I play? Oh yeah, Dungeon Siege 3. That's a good I game, too. I, uh, I still need to play a lot, because I want to beat it before the DLC comes out. But, um, it yeah. turned out a lot better than I expected. I think it's because I didn't like it as much because I played it on the computer. And I played Dungeon Siege 1 and 2 on the computer, which is where it started. So it didn't have that same feel as Dungeon Siege 1 and 2, but they made it better for the console, so it felt better on the console. It was more hack and slashy. It's more like reminding me of Baldur's Gate, Dark Alliance type of stuff. What was the game called? I wasn't listening. This is Dungeon, Dungeon Siege 3. 3. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> start paying attention. Yeah, start paying attention, maybe. No one. Deserves attention but me. Stop stop texting females and pay attention to us. I'm sorry. Sit in the corner by himself. Wait, I just say female. Z. Meaning his mother. No, actually. <laughs> They're all nubile and young. Fuck's nubile. So you're a pedophile. <laughs> not that young. <laughs> bastard. <laughs> At least it's not Donkey Kong, you fucking llama. <laughs> I'm a bitch. Hey, he's an animal. It's fair game. You haven't Ew. proved that yet. <laughs> that would be a really goddamn weird combo. A llama ape? Ape llama. Llama ape king? Uh, the llama. Dalai Lama. The dama. A uh, donama. Anyways. Lamadon. Dungeon Siege 3 is really good. I've yet to play it with someone, so I'm probably going to get my sister to 
try it out because <laughs> she likes those type of games. You can come over too. Hey. But you already played it. Yeah. How much have you? No, you haven't played that much though. No, I haven't. Like, cause I'm pretty far. I don't care about the story. I, I'm not. I'm like just paying loose attention to the I story. I can sort of kind I of. I mean, really, it's not really that hard of a story I, to follow. I can so. sort of kind of figure out what's gonna happen in the end. So. Which Probably. is sort of sad because this is upsetting. We were supposed to be like the next Bioware, and they keep on kind of like sinking lower and lower. Yeah. Like, just keep getting screwed. By you the just, man, man. You just get horrible IPs. They don't get horrible IPs. They just shit the bed with bugs. Did they have and stuff. hunted? You just do this on S. No, they didn't you know, do hunted. Who had hunted? Well, I don't know, but it was. Oh, it was Bethesda. By, yeah, it was yeah, published Bethesda. by yeah. Bethesda. Lucky but it was, they didn't make it. Yeah. But yeah, the game dropped to 30 bucks, eh? Hey? I know. That's a decent price for that game. I'm yeah. not going to buy it because I played it yeah, through like played five it. times. Well, twice with one, one of these characters, but... Not a third time. Really? Essentially. <laughs> well, you just... I wreck rented games, it's what I do. You just don't play bot games, really? No, I I take my time with bot games, because I want to, like... Uh, bot games? What's the How word I'm looking for? I want to, like... Played? What? How much like Gundam have, have you played? Gundam 3? Yeah. Like five hours. Is it? Maybe, like, seven. <laughs> Times five. Yeah, I played a lot of Gundam. How is oh, it? I forgot to even fucking mention that. I played yeah. Gundam three. Backtrack. Gundam. Yeah, go backtrack. So, so after, so Mass Effect three. I played Gundam three. No, how's Gundam that? Gundam Dynasty Warriors three. Yeah. It's really fun. Except some the fucking items still confuse the shit out of me. Because you can have like five different of the same suit at once, and they each have like their own like stat points, and you can only have five. So when you get like a sixth one, you have to delete one of the old ones, and you get a new piece for the. If you use a suit, every mission you complete with that suit gets you a new version of that suit. It's not always better. Sometimes it's way worse. <laughs> That doesn't really make sense. And so I, I, all I do is I just, I, I pour all my points into mobility and thrusters so I can just move really goddamn fast, because they don't, they can't really hurt me anyways. It's just like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm jutting all over the place and everyone's just like, oh my god, what the fuck's happening? <laughs> and then for my, you get like skill, skill abilities. You get to put on three, and I put speed up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, nice. like lightning. He does like, you can hit him like 19 times before they even react and I'm just gone already. <laughs> <laughs> but you're, so, uh, you're enjoying that game? I enjoy it. It does not translate well over to English though. No? Because, well, they try and like, make the pilots talk to each other. Sort of. Oh god. But what they've done <laughs> is they've quoted the show in all their like speeches. Mm. So they like piece the speeches together, so there will be they'll be really really random. So like, like the guy I play, he like and they'll every mission they'll say the same lines over and over again. And then like he'll be like, "You should fall back," and then the guy just in, in like a calm voice he says, "You should fall back," and then my guy will scream, "What are you saying? I know nothing about war and fighting!" And he'll just be like a pissy little <laughs> bitch for a second, nice. and then he'll be like, "No, I wasn't saying that." He's like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> like, what? Okay. I'm so confused. He's like, you better not be. <laughs> <laughs> Get old. And fast forward. Fast <laughs> forward. <laughs> blah blah blah. Michael Michael Michael. Uh, blah blah blah. blah. <laughs> All right, I'm done. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was done. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I'm. I don't know, I've kind of completed some games and... Well, one game, I guess. I didn't hit record. That would be bad. So... Fuck! So, quick, just, I'm just going to quickly go through some games. I mean, there's lots of this, but it's pretty much just touch-ups. The darkness I gave up on. What? I was supposed what? to use the black hole to take away this helicopter, right? It's not really a spoiler. You're supposed to take away this helicopter to the black hole. And if you don't do it, you're pretty much dead. And my game won't let me do that. Why? I don't know. Bugs. 
I've watched like a watch that was like, okay, this isn't working. So I went on YouTube and watched, make sure I'm doing something different. Wrong, I wasn't. I did a walkthrough, wasn't anything wrong, but it just won't let me do it. So I was like, whatever, okay, I'll just keep going. And then it's like you're like on the second level, and the helicopter's like in the sky, obviously. And then when you drop down, SWAT guys drop down, and then the helicopter spams you, and then these guys spam you, and then you just die. <laughs> yes. <sighs> that was the frustrating 20 minutes. So I stopped playing it. Maybe I'll go back to it, but yeah, that's it. Uh, just Wikipedia the story. I could, yeah, that's true, because I, <laughs> I was on a planet first, so I can get into darkness too. But yeah, then I got fours that I was playing, just still trying to complete all those stupid race things. Level 46, do the final one to be level 50. So, getting pretty close, but I don't think I'm going to complete it. Kind of boring. <laughs> um, starting a new game, though, it's Final, uh, final Fantasy 3. As you guys know, I picked it up the day of our last podcast. I haven't played a whole lot of it. I've only dumped like 11 hours into it. I guess I picked up the Valkyrie Chronicles, right? Yeah. yeah. But um, I'm not going to touch that until it beat Final Fantasy. My friend has, says it's really good. <coughs> My co-worker says he, hit, like, he has it on the PS3 or whatever. He says it's really, really good. He told me about like this cool thing. like uh, One of the characters, they have backstories and stuff, and like one of them is allergic to pollen, and like the different environment you're in can affect them. Uh, you apparently like switch into like first person mode or something when you shoot. Um, I don't think there's any I've shooting in this one. It's, Val- it's for DS. Oh, he said Valkyrie Chronicles. It's or is it, no, it's the Valkyrie profile. Oh, Valkyrie. Okay, no. Oh, okay. Totally Never mind. Different game. Oh, well, it's probably s- all Japanese. All good. Yeah, it's a plan from Fantasy Three. I mean, it starts the grind, grind, beat boss, move on. <laughs> I am enjoying it though. Like, it does. It does have a sense of humor, and I love how you have four set guys. But it doesn't matter because each of them can be like a different class. Like, there's warrior, thief, white mage, black mage, red mage, purple mage. Monk. What's the difference between the mage Kellys? White's healing based. Yeah. Black's damage based. I don't know the other ones. So. Red Red's is <laughs> black based like spread chicken. Red red mage is oh, more like oh, like you can do like poison and <laughs> blinding. Am I the only one who caught that? Yeah, very I cool. did. I'm just not ignoring it though. <laughs> Racist. Don't judge me. <laughs> yeah. So there's just I don't know. It's cool. Um, in mine right now, I have uh, two warriors, a black mage, and this one guy is kind of ironic. He doubles as a thief and a white mage. <laughs> is this um, before Final Fantasy comedy. was all about the crazy hair? They've yeah, always been about the crazy hair. These guys don't have that crazy hair. Define crazy hair, William. Like, like Final Fantasy Demetrius Gordon. You still not got in Dominic. the middle. N- no. Demethal. Denethor! Dead. It's Denethor! That's Lord of the Rings, bitch. <laughs> That's not Jewish. It's not Jewish? <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Is it Jewish ginger? Jewish ginger. No, it's that just... seems like a tongue twister. Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger. Anyways. Say that Anyways. five times fast. I was, uh, yeah, so... <laughs> I don't know, I was playing whatever and I got my ass handed me by a Medusa, so I trained... And then just just they went back. I was like whatever, I'll then see if I can beat it. Rat. No, yeah, fucking kicked your ass. And then I went on and beat the next. I don't know if you like. I guess big battles, not really boss battles, but two next big battles. So I'm, I'm moving through that game pretty good. It's really fun. Really enjoying it. Um, not sure I'm gonna beat it though. But when I beat it, that'll be the next time I talk about it. Um, That's what she said. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Bam! Um, wait, not really. that, that not, doesn't make sense. Not really. That's what she said. That's, what, like that's what he said. Yeah, yeah. next time. Pwned. Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger, Jewish ginger. Okay, no, that's not funny. I don't find it. Um, I, mean, I just find it fun to say. It's like chimichanga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love chimichangas. I used to eat those all the time. I don't have any chimichangas, but I got a, a red hot beef burritos. Seriously. Those are good. What? <laughs> and I got a chicken spinach pizza, too. Yeah, I'm those are now. good. So, then I did beat Spider Man Shattered Dimensions finally after taking like a whole month break after the game is free- frozen. 
But I really, it was cool because I was like, oh, I have to beat this whole boss again. But it saved me right at the boss fight where it froze. So I just had to jump back into that boss fight. That's good. So I was, that was really nice. Yeah, can I borrow it? <laughs> yeah, I can borrow it. Oh, fuck, it. that's a terrible idea. I'm taking yeah. Portal and Batman, by the way. Right now? Cool. No, you got well, four right games now. to be next week. Yeah, we'll I know. Yeah. That's why I got to beat him before next but week. But Dark <laughs> <laughs> See, this is why I like That's a work in my progress. easy schedule, which all you yeah, guys yeah. whine about. I'm like two hours in. Wait, He's, all I have it. to do is do. I totally be, forgot about it. Talk, no, okay, no, no. Just, just, uh, just talk about the next podcast. We yeah. Can, we can play more of it. Yeah. yeah. I, it, Trust me, you need to get further into the game to actually have a good grasp. Like, Luke's got, got, like, killed by all the games he's got to play. All I have to do is do Legacy, Arrival, and I get to start playing The Witcher 2 again. Do you know what the best cure for that is? What? Not to be a bitch. Mm-hmm. You play games. Don't yeah, okay, watch we'll, we'll, talk, we'll, we'll talk about what, what happens Horizon. in our next segment. Okay, yeah, so it be Spider-Man. I really do like the final boss battle, because it is one guy, but you use all four, uh... Sp- Spider-Man to beat him. First one you use is uh, Spider-Man Noir, and I really liked it because it's got the same thing. If you guys ever played Batman Arkham Asylum with Scarecrow in the middle, and it shines his light around, and you kind of got to go from yeah, shadow run to away. shadow, uh, yeah, yeah, without being seen. That's how you did it, but you just how you kept going closer and closer. Perfect, I absolutely loved it. Then uh, for a futuristic Spider-Man, I mean, I don't know if this is really spoilers. He's not really story. Or anything. Not really. Uh, futuristic like Spider Man twenty ninety nine. It's just like a free, it's like especially with like a free fall thing. It's like you're uh you guys probably don't you guys don't know unless you've watched my let's plays or seen anything in Spider Man's higher dimensions. It's just a free fall and going straight down. That's all his missions? No, that's just some parts of his. Oh. That's, that's, like, that's like his thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all his missions are free falling. <laughs> no, it's cool. So much for Spider Man. <laughs> because the boss is down the bottom, and keep free falling closer and closer. And then, the, uh, of course, the boss sends out things you gotta dodge and that. And then, yeah, so that one was really cool. For Ultimate Spider Man, what he does, he's. It's kind of funny because it, it glitched out of me. He's supposed to send out these orbs. And like, kind of like, uh, what the orbs do is they remake when when your bosses you battle and they like charge at you, so you gotta like dodge them. So, but it didn't come out of his hand when I was playing the first time. And they keep telling me to attack these orbs like I was stupid. <laughs> but I could never reach his orb because it was stuck in his hand. So, again I, had to tr- again I had to restart it, thinking that it glitched or something. And it did glitch because it's supposed to come out of his hand. But yeah, so pretty much what you do is you dodge, then you attack those orbs to do damage to them. That was fun. Then your amazing Spider-Man was just, um, it was just pretty much, you go from like clump to clump, beat a crap load of enemies on each clump, and then shoot something at him. It was it's like a straightforward fight. Yeah. 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 Typical boss battle. But yeah, and then the ending was really cool. I loved how like did the ending like the whole ending sequence was really well done, and had it had humor too. I really like that, <laughs> and yeah, so that's all Spider Man. Um, I definitely recommend people to go pick it up. Um, I'm just gonna give it a rating because I can. I'd probably give it a fresh, so a four out of five. <laughs> <laughs> In case people don't know, because I haven't really talked about our rating system yet. No. <laughs> Oh God, I, think, I think it's because we all forgot about it again. To... <laughs> no, I like my rating system. We're going to keep it. I forgot how it works. Okay, you can stop. Um, <laughs> control. Um, playing more Bioshock. Not really much to say. Not far enough in the game yet. Tried Oblivion. I was having fun with that game. Never played before. <laughs> Blast toys. You <laughs> named them Blast Toys. Oh um, I wanted to call him Blasto, uh, but they wouldn't let. Him. <laughs> he wanted to call him Blast Toys. He was he was like black as night. Yeah, he was black as. He night. looked like Darth Maul, but he had a really pointy yeah. Jew face. We t- we t- we t- came the like parents made <laughs> another thing really race. We we hey, <laughs> that, they're not a race. Racist comment. <laughs> no, we just made everything really big on his face. Oh, you guys know I'm prejudiced. <laughs> he just made it really everything on his face pretty much like maxed out, and then just made him like super black. Four foot face going outward. 
That was funny. And then I, I was turned just I was turned just an archer and then shooting, just rats shooting rats in the face and having fun and then shooting goblins or whatever. I wanted I didn't play a lot. It was fun though. Um, uh, stupid arc lane dancing got me into lol. Oh. I got a la 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 I found this chat That's our intro I found this chat Lame Now we just gotta get that little fucker in on it Yeah, llama Champion that I really like is like Articuno from Pokemon but of it's course Anivia. it's like one of the most expensive ones in the game, so I gotta save well, up like for it. They're like all expensive, it's ridiculous. So yeah, I gotta save up for that. I may, I may just buy points to get it that way, but it's not yeah. as fun. No, it is fun, because once you get a, a hero you really like, yeah, it makes you play it getting points ever. so much easier. Because you're having so much fun playing that hero. Hard to play, fun. though. But I'm having fun as You new say new. that about everyone! Yeah, because they're all hard to play yeah, in their you, own like, way. I was like talking about the there's I'm the bottom heroes that they recommend for new idiot. people. You're like, oh, he's hard to play. It's like, then why is he motherfucking recommended? <laughs> Which one? Everyone! Every single hero, I'm like, I want to play him. You're like, oh, he's hard to play. You're picking all the hard people to play. Then I do good with right. all of them. It's because they're hard to play right, probably. I don't care if I play I, them right. I, yeah. So what if he's meant to be a tank? I make him damage per second. Why the fuck not? Really? <laughs> because I always, always you're going to get... Um, I didn't though. Well, yeah. Are you going to a shitty game with shitty people? Yet. Oh, level thirty. Yeah, once you hit level thirty, that's when it's gonna matter. Well, yeah, <laughs> because you can't get any further up from level thirty. So you have a guy who should be like a level ninety billion, but he's a level, level thirty. Ninety billion. Ninety billion dollars. Nine thousand. So yeah, nine. one million dollars. <laughs> so I'm just, I I'm just playing as Nunu. That. He's just a small kid running, yeti. running a yeti. And yeah, so I'm just Nunu. It's fun. So yeah, I'm get, I'm getting into that. Um, kind of gonna go off of something I'm not really playing, but I completed. Um, Dead Man, uh, Dead Man's uh, Wonderland, an anime I just completed. You guys don't know I'm a huge anime fan. I watch a lot of anime. I didn't know that. <laughs> what do you do now? I didn't know that. <laughs> no, nah, it's just power. Today I thought this site was offensive to women. Then I realized I didn't care. What? <laughs> that was completely random. I'm but... reading, reading My Life is Bro. Uh. <laughs> Brought to you by My Life is Bro. Okay, yeah, so I finished that. It's cool because these guys are called dead men. Uh, okay, so give the premises. Premises is that there's this jail that um, these sound like people who are on the death death row to, and um, but they do what they do. They have like um, games going on, and they use these games to get cast points. These cast points can do like cigars, clothes, entertainment, food, everything. For these inmates, because if they win these games, they get cast points or whatever. Nice. And people come watch them, so that's like the main attraction. That's what it's called, yeah. Dead, Dead Man's uh, Wonderland. Hmm. But what a dead man is, they're in their separate block, and you can pretty much just uh, control their blood. Nice. Like some people can use it as like an armor. Some people can actually use this projectile. This one guy can use his blades. blades. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no arclight. No. You're the only one laughing. That's that's an arclight joke. <laughs> what? <laughs> what you just did? No, we were talking about Will and I were talking about blood mages once, and I brought up the fact that a woman's period, she would be the oh most god. superior <laughs> blood mage alive. You had to mention it on the show. Of course I did. <laughs> No this is our worse play than play. Jew face. <laughs> yeah, that's why did you call him Jew face? Demetrius? <laughs> no. Denifor? Debbie. Dari it's Darius, isn't it? <laughs> Darius? No. Dora the Explorer. It's a common name. You Devin. People. No. Dinkle. <laughs> How many, Dar Dar How many people do you know called Dinkle? Dudley! <laughs> no. Damn it. This is difficult. Is so, um, difficult? I meet people with this name? Hmm? I meet people with this name? You probably will meet people with this as a first name, yeah. Dakota. 
Dakota. It's a male name, dumbass. Dakota can be a Dakota male, be a male name. name. Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> you will. Oh, well. I feel kind of sorry. Mr. Hardman is Derek. No. Dragon. Dreidel. Okay, anyway, we'll go back to what I was talking about. High fives. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that was, that was a cool one. I'd recommend people pick it up. We'll just go look at it. Um, it is in Japanese, so you gotta just watch subtitles. But this is only a 12 part uh, series, too. Really easy to watch. And I am showing this really cool book. It's the History of Oct Oct uh, Optimus Prime and Megatron. They have gay sex. <laughs> You ruin everything. I don't ruin everything. It's a Transformers book. <laughs> you know yeah, it's called being a petrol sexual. You just ruined the whole thing. Okay, we're gonna move on to our second segment now. Yeah. Well, there, no, there. Do we do you want to? Do we want to talk Are about uh, heavy rain, or do you want? No, I just... think we should save that for a different. Well, aren't we gonna Why? do it for a different week? Teaser. Why? Because <laughs> he's seen some of it. I guess. I thought we were gonna make this shorter though, so. Well, we can make it short. I don't really well, care. Well, let's just leave it as a teaser for next time. <laughs> oh, yeah. such a tease. Because, I mean, it is a hard game to talk about, Durr. in my opinion. Is it? It's just, is your middle name Derp? There's a lot to talk about. No. Herp Derp? Nope. Derp Okay, so I guess you won't talk nope. about it. Our second segment is loop on Herp <laughs> Derp. <laughs> our third segment is we're going to talk about our future plans for this podcast. Kind of. A.K.A. Well, games we're playing. Not really a future <laughs> For your plans, it's just a change that we're doing. I guess that's true. Just change. a different way we're gonna present things. Yeah. Uh, so, are we still gonna do that second segment? I mean, we're kind of discussing it over. Is our second segment gonna be a one said game, or are we gonna talk about the games that we're re reviewing? I think if we end up talking about the games that we're reviewing, considering that we've signed on those games, we're gonna have to go more in depth on them. And, and do you remember sure. how many games I have? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's gonna. <laughs> I think take we're just gonna go through game by game. I think that'll though. just end up being the first segment. Yeah. I like. I kind of like because what, what I what played we that week will be the games I review. <laughs> yeah. Not for I, me. I'm, I'm probably not gonna play much other thing, uh, anything else. Other. I'm than gonna me. be straight fucked for the next four months. No, you're not. <laughs> you have. Their next week you're fucked. And no, then... I just moved in with this big Samoan guy. I'm gonna be straight <laughs> fucked for the next three months. <laughs> I'm sure he's Kay. nice. Next, <laughs> next, next week you're really busy. Then you have two weeks off, pretty, pretty much. But to Gears play the other there. games that I'm going to be really yeah. busy during. But Gears is in there, and then you have your last week of September, you're fucked. Ooh, what's in the last week? I can't remember. Um, so the so guy have, is going to go on a break. You and have he's gonna come back. You have Altelier, Tori. Alt uh, I forgot what that is. Yeah, I know. You just speak up because of your own name. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's um, right. <laughs> you have Ico and Shad... Uh, and oh, I could. Of, uh, Colossus. Oh yeah. And, oh, um, so Black good. You can come over. Uh, and uh, uh, Black Knight Sword. Watch me play. Yeah, I wasn't gonna play it. Like, no, no, he's not games. saying anything. <laughs> I'm listening. I wasn't. I heard Shadow of Pl Voltron. When's Voltron? That's the end of October. Oh. Okay. <laughs> no. I was um, gonna buy the Voltron pilot suit for my avatar. <laughs> 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 uh, we could all get them. I call dibs on red. I'm Bye. yellow. Well, Sorry, red right here. You know what? Ginger. That's you true. can be orange. And I'm definitely the leader anyway. It, hardly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm totally the leader. I'm the leader. If everyone hates the leader, then maybe. <laughs> she won't have a leader. It'll be a democracy. Okay, yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and review uh, the big releases of every week and like other sub games that we kind of want to play. Yeah. Like next week... Like, like, I wouldn't say they're all. We're gonna catch all of them though, because I mean, there's tons on Steam that I'd probably play, but that weren't on the list that we were looking at. So, okay, we're talking about big multi-platform games. Yeah. Well, not multi-platform, but like well, they're big, big, big. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! It is. <laughs> Ow! Yeah. <laughs> 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 Didn't this just happen in the last <laughs> one? <laughs> that was gotta be one of the biggest fails I've ever seen in my life. And I've seen many. Oh, we're gonna get it from under your bed. <laughs> uh.
Oh, Bob. This is Jedi Pony's laugh. Well, Fear him. Well, Jedi regained his composure. Play by play. I didn't see all of it, but apparently I thought I chipped my Arc Light for a second. dropped his phone on his face, which <laughs> consequently bounced off and landed under Jedi's bed. I can't get it. It's bullshit. Just <laughs> can't see the podcast. You're not supposed to be texting anyways. I'm sorry. Okay, so... Hmm, well, um, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> anyways. I mean... It hit me right in the eye. Fuck. <laughs> How did you hit me in the eye, though? Your glasses are. Right? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I was just in the middle of responding to someone. I wonder where I went. <laughs> it's going to be a random go? response. With like it's going to be like, like and hues. <laughs> if my arm gets stuck, cut it off. Okay, leave it. <laughs> leave it till the end if of the podcast. If it gets stuck, we're, letting, we're leaving you there. I got it. Hey, a dart. <laughs> What, what kind? Okay, so Ow. we'll get back to our third That's segment. That's sharp. What is that? Don't throw shit at me. No, it's not shit, it's a knife. Ow! Anyway. Got it! Oh, it's all so busted. where were we? Okay, we're, okay, we're talking about, uh, so like, the week, so pretty much like the week of September, we kind of talk about, what, are we going to do a podcast every two weeks during school? Yeah. I guess we we, we kind of start school September 7th, so... University. University! Second year, just yeah, specifying. Yeah, we are so, you know, high class, you know, sipping on a we're, tea. We're starting grade 10. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, <laughs> so yeah. I like um, boobs. <laughs> so the week of September 7th, um, should we say who's, who's reviewing what game? Or do you want to just say what games we're going to be reviewing? Isn't that the exact same thing? <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> no. That's, oh. the, <laughs> that's no. the exact same thing. No, what, what I mean just, is... Just run them through. Do we want to say, like, who's reviewing what game? Or are we going to say, like, what the podcast is going to be reviewing? Let's just run yeah, through the September. Yeah, let's just run through. All of September? Just, just let's just explain the September stuff, and then we Kay. can get into yeah. October stuff when we're actually closer. Okay, yeah. yeah. So, okay. So I guess because we don't know when the next podcast is going to be. So for September, what we have is um, ArcLight is doing Resistance Three. Yeah. ArcLight is also doing Warhammer Forty K Space Marine. Yeah. Uh, dancing Arc ArcLight and Jedi are doing Dead Island. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how to say this one. This, this gay guy. This is what? Michael, you're Asian. Go. This gay or? This gay? This gay. Something like that. Hey, this gay. Uh, this gay four is Arclight. Yeah. And uh, Jedi doing a uh, this yeah. Alliance. Just a note on Crimson Alliance is that they have multiple ways to pay. If you know that it's a hack and slash game like Baldur's Gate and kind of those old ones, if you know that you only want to play one class like the warrior or the thief or the mage or whatever it is, you can buy the game at a reduced rate and only have the one class to play. That's pretty cool. So Smart it's idea. a cheaper way to get into it, especially if you know that you're never going to play a mage. Hmm, that's pretty cool. That is kind of cool. Um... Then the week after that, only b- game we're reviewing is uh, NHL 12, and um, Jedi's doing that. Then the week after that, I guess, so I don't know what we're going. So it's the 7th, and that was the 14th is when NHL 12 comes out. And uh, and, it, and September 21st, that week, um, Jedi's going to do F1, is it 2011, I'm assuming? To so that game, um... Arc Ar- Ar- Legend Gears of War 3. Yeah, yeah. And oh, Dancing is doing a Lu- uh, Lucius. Whoop, whoop. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's going to be a fun week thing. Whoop, whoop. He did that one down on the knee. He goes down. Oh, you ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, now yeah. we're on uh, September 28th week. Um. Um, Lama actually has a game he's reviewing finally. Oh! 
Oh, Wait, uh, we should just send him to like review Machinima fucking YouTube videos or some shit. Yeah, yeah, you gotta understand that I also have Dragon Age 2 Legacy, I have Mass Effect 2 Arrival that I'll be playing, and I will also be getting back into The Witcher 2, so I'll be able to review those I have games. Dragon Age. We can make him like DLC man, too. And we'll also it's probably true. be able to do <laughs> a bit Dickle more man. of an in depth <laughs> review of Bastion just so that we have the entire game finished. Both me and ye. He and thinks he's gonna do more. it better than you. Bastion. I'm surprised they beat before you, man. Well, I didn't really devote a whole night to it or anything like that. Yeah, I was so like, what? 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 what, what has he played? Oh, Team Fortress. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> I like it in small doses. Bastion's nice because you can pick it up, play a level, and then yeah. Well, Be that's even. I played a hell of a lot of it because I was going into the arena so I get more experience. Yeah. Because I was not. I need to get more. do penalties by invoking gods for harder difficulty. I have four active right now. Oh. Four <laughs> what active? In Bastion, you can raise you know, the like difficulty by. Halo, it's sort of the same concept. Except it rewards you with more experience and more money. By invoking the gods, they're going to add something difficulty, like more health, regenerating or health, they, or wider range of Yeah, I got one that they drop aggro. grenades after they die. Oh, okay. That one's tough. That's why I switched to range weapon. But anyways. I die. So, yeah, the, these are just, like, big games. Don't like any <laughs> games, or even, like, Steam games won't be in here. Yeah. But I'm sure our dancing will add some Steam games yeah. into it. Yeah, I got some good so, ones. Um, so the week of September 28th, we got uh, FIFA 12, really big game, I'm really excited for that. Um, so Jedi and Lama's doing that. Uh, at <laughs> that seems so odd, I, I don't know, know why. I don't know if it's the it's fact that Arca somebody Arca wanted to Arca review Arca a sports game. game. Which one is it? The Atelier. Atelier. Atelier to Tori. Is uh I'm no, I don't even remember that. I can't remember movie. what it is, but yeah. I just picked it because it had a cool name. What no, the it, no, there was there was something cool <laughs> for it. I, I'm, I'm pretty <laughs> sure it was like a hack and stash or something. Maybe it, probably. I, I could be way off. That is but like, I know. Watch it's it be like uh, Arc, a dating Arc sim. Doing that. <laughs> I don't care. I like dating sims. Sometimes. Alright, alright. Uh, uh, don't admit to that. <laughs> uh, the PS3 is having that Ico and Shadow Colossus HD remake. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Arc, uh, Arc guys doing that too. This motherfucker. That week, um, dancing is doing a uh, uh, Defenders of of Ardenia. Whoop whoop. That's. I do want to talk about what it is, or just. I don't remember what it is. It's you're pretty much. It's like the opposite of a tower defense game. Oh yeah, yeah you're the one. monsters rather than yeah. the Defendor. Yeah, and Defendor. Um, Dumbledore. <laughs> Dumbledore! <laughs> run, 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 run. Easy. <laughs> Snape. Snape. Severus Snape. Dumbledore. Severus Snape. Dumbledore. Snape. Severus Snape. Dumbledore. Okay. <laughs> um, then, um, Jedi is doing Amy, which is, and, um... The dating sim? And, <laughs> no, it's a horror. It's gonna be pretty fucking It's a dating badass. sim about a whore? It's gonna be <laughs> horror. It's gonna be badass. The horror. Myself. <laughs> and, um... It's like the wrecking ning ning ning. <laughs> Jedi is doing also, uh, X-Men uh, Destiny, which looks really fucking awesome. And bring bring up the last game of September is Arclight. We're doing a Black Knight Sword. <laughs> and we don't know. Okay, <laughs> 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 so it's kind of how many games Arc uh, Arclight has. He has one, two, <laughs> three, four, five, six, seven, eight games. In yes, you're doing in September. one month. I can do this. Challenge accepted. Face. <laughs> no, he has a hand on his head, doesn't he? Pretty sure he has had the There you go. This effect <laughs> is very much lost in the fact that we're on a podcast. Do you know what? Yeah. At least I narrated it, you motherfucker. Uh, that was a little right. unnecessary. So yeah, that's our kind of our cool new review thing we're gonna be doing. Hopefully we can cover more games, so if you wanna keep up in like up to date games, 
We can do that. And of course, you guys want to email us games you want us to. We're so lonely. Email us. Lonely. Like, it can even be like older games that you want us to look at, review, whatever. The first yeah. email gets an internet <coughs> cookie. Also, a naked picture of Will. The first? No. I think we should do something big for the first email. Like Invite them onto the podcast. Yeah, if you email us first, we'll invite you guys onto the podcast via Skype. Or, yeah, Skype. It has to be Skype. It has to be Skype. <laughs> we'll fly you over here We're and invite you to Jedi's horror, basement. So apparently. You'll come into Jedi's basement where we will feed you some sketchy materials. You may pass out and your butthole may hurt when you wake up. And we'll, we'll be satisfied. That's the power fruit. With the power <laughs> You'll fruits. find a banana in your asshole. <laughs> the power fruit. Signed by all of us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's because we, we, we can send him an apple that we all signed. You know how rotten that would be by the time <laughs> it gets there. Okay, a dried apple. A dried oh. apple. Just like all shriveled up. There's our signature. I'm going to oh. bag of crispers. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, <laughs> whoever sends us the first email will like, <clears throat> get invited onto this podcast if, if they want to. <laughs> and if that doesn't happen, I don't know. I'll, like. Well, uh, I'll donate like five dollars or ten dollars, and you can get a Steam game or something like there that. There we go. We'll we'll put together. You guys can get a Steam game or, a or Xbox, Xbox Live or Live. PS, uh, PSN card. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll we'll do send that. Send you the code. We'll do that. So the first Will does not like this idea for some. Oh, you cheap son of a bitch! Dude, it's going to get famous. I'm just be famous. We it's be just famous by our integrity. <laughs> it's just fuck integrity. Go it's money. <laughs> <coughs> Give him back to the community. You only can use ploys and tricks. Winning people, people over like with charm is dead. Now it's all about money and bitches. Because all of us know that. Uh, <laughs> also, whoring yourself. Like being, being a gamer is a very expensive hobby. Also, Jedi will get your name tattooed it. on his nutsack. <laughs> no, I'll, I'll make a video about that game you guys want us to review. So a lie. If it's a game, I the can. cake is a lie. Okay, we'll, we'll find someone to make a review of the game you want us to review and put it on one of one of our channels. But we'll do also. The first... Okay, here we'll run through it just quickly so everyone knows what's going on. Our first email can either be on our podcast and they can promote their channel if they want or whatever they want to promote um, on our podcast. They can get a Steam game or a PSN or an Xbox Live. Points card. What about Wii points? Maybe we got some okay, sick Wii, we points. Or Wii points. points. Or Wii we points. We gotta throw someone who plays Wii iTunes games on this pitch. Or an iTunes gift card. Handheld games are off limits. Yeah. No handheld games and no like retail Steam games. Yeah. Like, I'd no, say like, like 20 bucks and under. Yeah. So yeah. And then if up. anyone wants us to review a game, well, we will do our best to make a video of it. And post on one of one of our channels, either Dancing's channel or Jumbo Bat's channel. Yeah. Um. So keep in tune for that. Please subscribe to both of us. We're kind of boosting ourselves. Promotion. Yeah. Boost Shameless uh, self. I can make like nineteen fake files and just subscribe. Email us at for you can email us at <coughs> powerfruitcast at gmail dot com. That is true. We will put it in the show notes. Put it in the show notes. That's and I'll put P. it on. My oh. YouTube video that I put up of the podcast. Um, hopefully next week we'll have our new logo up. Yeah. That uh, our city working logo. <laughs> it's a it's a logo nonetheless. I haven't seen it yet. Yeah. But it should be pretty cool. There's a reason I'm probably not doing graphic design. <laughs> what? Oh. Hey. 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 It's an alarm. Hey. Calm down. Why it's Buddha for Shiznit's birthday today. Ow. Oh. <laughs> anyway. Just fucking throw a penny at me. Yeah. It could have been a goddamn loony. prostitute. Could have been a loony. No, it's a penny. I know, but it could have been loony. That would have hurt more. I would have preferred that. Then I would have had a loony. Yeah. Actually, it'll hit me in the teeth. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll look, I'll take a look at your logo. It's funny looking at Jedi right now. If he's upside down, he still has a beard and hair. And that's a wrap. I'm so pumped for Arkham City! Oh, my voice. <laughs> Your voice stopped. <laughs> <laughs> you almost choked on you. No, I'm there. excited to read this comic book. It's like five bucks. That give you the I, issues. Like, <laughs> five comics. Shut the fuck up. 
Five comics in the collection that do the intro to Arkham City. So pumped through that. I'm going to review that next podcast because, yeah. Pump, pump, pump. And I'm just going to kill um, Arkite with this penny. Arkite? Did you really just call me Arkite? Yeah, it was because you don't... No one can either. fucking get my name right. Alright, well, I'm always dancing uh, signing off. <laughs> I'm Lama King. I'm Jedi Poner. And I'm Arclight. Goodbye. See you guys later.